progress on the cure? We need it as soon as possible, or life as we know it could change forever. No, the virus has little to no effect on any animal we've tested it on. Every time we even come close to a solution, the virus mutates and, well, all our data is made useless. We must be looking at this wrong. There has to be a solution. It goes against our ideals, but we could experiment on humans. You know very well we can't do that. We are meant to save lives, not take them. You're not looking at the big picture here. A few lives could save millions, even billions. <sighs> it goes against my ideals as well, but I would have to agree. We became scientists to save humanity through any means possible, even if it means doing things we aren't proud of. Very well. I'll arrange for some test subjects. Till then, continue on experimentation. These are dark days we are living in, and our humanity will be tested. George, is that you? George, are you okay? George, what happened to you? Hey, you! Oh my gosh, you, you don't look too good. Wait, you don't look human. Oh my gosh! sleep after yesterday. Gosh, I think I'm going... Uh, I think I'm sick with something. The flu. I gotta get out of bed. Uh, I think after seeing George just get... Uh, man, what happened to George? Am I going insane? What is going on with me? I have to go see Unspeakable right away. I think this flu probably got the best of me so far, but I don't know if I'm sick, but ah, uh, man... George just getting these heavy flashbacks right now all about just seeing George and those things that got him last night. What was that? Ah, God, the flashback. My gosh, I gotta get to unspeak well right away. This is bad. I don't know if I have the flu. We gotta go see a doctor or something. I don't know. Unspeakable. Open up, dude. I know you're closed. Open up. Are you here? What? What? It's, oh, um, it's, it's Sunday, me. man. It's, it's closed. What's going on? I'm coming. I, I'm coming. I know it's closed, but something bad's happening. I need to get in now. <sighs> yeah, man, what's going on? Go ahead, speak your word. All right, all right. I was at the docks last night, and something bad happened to my boss, George. He, he was, he was being eaten by something. Are you serious? Cause I saw the same thing last night with my neighbor Johnny. He wasn't being himself. Yeah, he just wasn't himself. He was making weird noises, and I went over there, and he just. He didn't look like him. He didn't act like him at all. That's exactly what I saw. Like I, I was walking by my my containers and everything, and I saw these this this undead th this dead thing just like creeping up, and I don't know. It looked and made weird noises. I don't even know if it was alive. Like, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. That's really weird. I think we should go to the hospital and talk to the professionals about this. They know all about this know. whole flu outbreak. Do you, do you think we're infect? Do you think we we have an infection? Or are we are we sick with I this think flu? I, I, I honestly don't know. I think we're going to be fine, but before it gets any more serious, I really think we need to go to the hospital right now. It's a Sunday. My coffee shop is closed. I don't have any business here, so today's going to be the best day. All right, man. I guess I guess we got to make it. I don't know. I'm a bit nervous, dude, but I really hope I'm not sick. Let's, let's make our way to the hospital. All right, let's go. So what exactly did you see, man? What's so going it, on? It was basically like I, I was walking by and I saw this this dead thing kind of eating into my boss George and and I was so nervous I didn't have enough time to look at it and I just ran for it I, I don't know man I'm really nervous I, I really am it's okay about, man. last I night know. I was locking up my coffee shop and I heard some really strange noises I didn't know what it was and it had to be my neighbor Johnny and it was just I went over there and he's just 
he wasn't him he just he was just someone else i just ran locked my coffee shop up and then that was that now it looks like we're at the hospital i guess we got to talk to someone maybe they're at the front desk or something upstairs or something yeah, but we gotta tell we, we gotta tell the doctors what's going on because this can be something bad and i don't know if we have it but whatever the case is this doctor has to help us out somehow or another all right do you think we can go check upstairs yeah let's go let's go i think he should be there i'm not sure Hey, hey, you at the table. We need to talk to you. Listen, we, we both saw something. We need to speak to a doctor right away. Uh, can I have your names, please? Uh, mine's Alexton. My name's Unspeakable. All right. Give me one moment. All right, dude. We Hopefully this doctor's going to help us out. I don't know what's yeah, going to happen. Yeah, I know. Uh, Dr. Dr. Jonas will see you right through there. Okay, great. Thank you so much. No problem. Hey doctor, how's it going? Well, I'm alright, thanks. Uh, what did you two want to talk about? Alright, so, um, well, let me just get, tell you the story on my side. I was at the docks, that's where I work, and uh, my, my boss, his name was George, and I was walking, and then all of a sudden I see this type of zombie figure, and my boss was dead on the ground. I, I don't know what's going on. And then Unspeakable here, he, he has another story as well. Yeah, I have a very similar story. My neighbor next to my coffee shop, I live in my coffee shop, and I was closing up my coffee shop, and he was making some really weird noises, so I went to go check on him because me and him are very good friends, and he just wasn't him. He was having, like, I guess you could say zombie-like features. He just wasn't him. Zombies. Do you even hear what's coming out of your bloody mouth? Yeah, I think we're more I mean, than sure. I mean, I yeah. I mean, we can't tell for sure, but I think by the way it looked like they they had blood. They had, uh, I mean, I don't know. Unspeakable. What do you think? You think it's a zombie? I mean, it possibly could be. I'd have never seen a zombie in my life, so I can't really tell you what a zombie looks like. But that's the closest one I can see. Yeah, I think so too. What do you think, Doctor? Well, I think you two have been working too much. How about you take the next few days off and we can discuss this again when you're thinking rationally. Alright, I, I, I thank you so much, Doctor. I mean, I hope this helps us out. If anything, we'll return our way back here and we'll, we'll see what will, will, ha what will happen to us. I don't know. Thank you, Doctor. Right, let's go, Unspeakable. Hey, hey, look at this guy. Patient 4. Status has a broken leg nausea what happened to him i don't know man i hope he's okay it looks a bit strange i hope he maybe he's having a flu too like us but i think the doctor said we don't have a flu so we should um, be fine nah we're fine man i think he'll be okay too hopefully all right well let's go now let's head out oh man so this doctor i mean he was talking to us like you know maybe we were just tired you think that's the case I mean, it might be. I've been working a lot. The Frappuccino sales have gone up a ton. That's I mean, true. It, it might be a thing. Who I knows? Think, I think I have to try one of those Frappuccinos. Maybe that'll help my, you know, ease out a bit. I mean, yeah. they're going on sale for about a dollar fifty to $2 now, depending on what size you want. They're, <laughs> they're really nice. That's not bad, actually. I think, you know what? I think we're a bit overworked up. Let's just go back home, I guess. All right, yeah. I think we should just go home. Oh my gosh, dude, there's oh. zombies again. Oh my gosh. We gotta get out of here. Go. What? Go. We gotta get out of here. We gotta go. We gotta get to the hospital um, as fast as we can. Uh, take the bridge. Take the yeah, bridge. Yeah, we gotta we gotta tell the doctor. I don't know what's going on. I don't think we're going crazy. Alright, there's the hospital. Let's go, let's go. No, we're definitely not going crazy now. Oh my gosh, dude! There's a herd oh of zombies! My gosh. Take the trees, we gotta go through. Oh my this. gosh, shake. Okay. Follow me, follow me. Are we going? Alright, I'm following you. Go, 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 go. We gotta get hey, there's that guy again. Alright, keep going. He's fighting them off. Go around, follow me. We gotta get to your okay, coffee I'm shop. following you. We gotta get to my coffee shop. I have an underground base. Oh. Not for just making frappuccinos, but for a lot of guns and special stuff, you know, just in case someone wants to break into my coffee shop. Dude, that's awesome. I didn't even know you had this. All right, but this is bad. We got to get out of here. Okay, go inside. Go inside. I don't even All know. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Right, where do you go? Where do you go? These these doors are reinforced. All right. We're good. All right, cool. <sighs> oh, my gosh. What was that? What was that? Was that the doctor getting mauled by zombies? I don't know, man, but I don't think it's safe out there anymore. I, I saw, like, the doctor, and then there was a part at the intersection. It was like... This guy running from another group of zombies, and he was bleeding out, I think. I don't know. I think one of those zombies that were chasing that guy was Johnny. It looked like him. I don't I don't know. That was... What is going on? 
I don't know, but I think the same thing happened to George. He got like attacked by these zombies as well, and and they looked exactly the same. They looked like human life form and everything, but just bloody and dead like. I don't know, but the doctor said we got to get some rest, right? You said you had a basement or something. I don't know. What do you think is best? Yeah, I do have a basement full of a lot of equipment that we can easily survive a week or two with. Um, I think we should just get some rest and maybe in the morning we can check it out because it is getting late. I don't think it can get much worse than what we just saw. I say let's go ahead and come in here and get some rest. All right, man, let's do that. You know, I think you're right. I don't know. It could be just a little thing, but let's just hope, you know, we'll go check out the basement tomorrow. Like you said, maybe we have enough gear to survive, but I'm pretty sure the government has this under control. I mean, I hopefully they do. This is a big city. I don't think we have much to worry about. Let's go ahead and get some rest so we can check out the basement tomorrow morning. All right, let's go.